You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video, and by NewTek, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. Hey guys, welcome back to the continuing coverage here at CES Live 2014. I'm John P. And I'm Derek Kessler. And we have a very special guest with us today. We've got Chaz from LG. Hello. Thanks hey, for joining. Absolutely, thanks for having me. Appreciate I feel it. so underdressed. I'm just here with my little rolled up sleeves. <laughs> These guys look all hot. What are you going to do? Yeah, <laughs> it's all right. We'll forgive Please you. Please forgive me. Thanks. Appreciate it. So you've got some exciting stuff. I mean, LG is just going nuts with all kinds of, of, of announcements. I see, see something on the desk. I know we're going to get to in a minute, but what, what, what are the like, key highlight things that you guys are pimping this year? <laughs> that we're promoting. Sure. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> sorry. No problem. We're in Vegas, right? <laughs> uh, there are three, probably three big things right now. The first of which you just alluded to, the LG G Flex. It's the world's first curved, flexible smartphone. Um, we've got the new LifeBand Touch. We've also got the world's first uh, curved, flexible 77-inch uh, Ultra K uh, Ultra HD TV. So wait a minute, <laughs> did you say a flexible, flexible? TV? Yeah, absolutely. So this thing, uh, when you're sitting there with your nice remote, with a touch of a button, you can actually have it flex toward you. Wait a minute. Yeah. Whoa. So, wait, you, yeah. it's remote controlled flexing? You bet. I, he wants one. Yeah. <laughs> so is everybody. Yeah, so is everybody. Uh, it's in concept form now, but it, it, you can count on it coming you know, at some point. And it can immerse you in the action itself, just like any curved OLED does that LG's on the forefront of. But now you can actually change that angle depending on where you're sitting in the home or oh, wherever you have it. So That is pretty nice. nice. Yeah, but, and that's not too unlike this, the LG G Flex, which uh, I'm sure you all have seen before. We have seen it. Yep. I've not seen it in person, though. Okay. So this is the first time for me. It looks like yep. a normal phone, except when you turn it sideways, well, it's except like, when you do this, or that. you can actually, it actually okay, flexes that's it's true to its name. Phone. That's yeah. just not right. Yeah. Well, you scare me when you no, do No, it's, 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 it's actually okay. So it was made <laughs> like this on purpose okay. for about three, to three separate reasons, right? Yeah. So hear better, hold better, view better. Pretty easy. It fits to the contour of your face much better. You get a little bit better sound pickup. Uh, you can hold it a little bit easier. If you know it's a six inch uh, HD screen, you can hold it much easier because of that curve. And just like those TVs we we're talking about, you're much more immersed in the viewing experience itself. So um, here we are, the LG G Flex announced yesterday on Sprint, AT&T, and T-Mobile, all coming in the first quarter and pretty, pretty soon in the first quarter. Why is Verizon always left out of these things? <laughs> You'd have to ask them. I know. Uh, they I, did take. I, believe uh, me, I have many times. <laughs> I mean, you know, they've got our LG G2, which yeah. is all over, and they have very good success with that. They've had great success with the Lucid, the Spectrum, and Spectrum 2. So, you know, we continue to have uh, good relations with all our carrier partners, and we'll see where things go in the future. Now, what goes into making this actually be able to be curved? Because I know a lot of the components that go into these traditionally are very flat and square, rigid components. You're right, good question. So, we had to draw up on LG Chem, a sister company, to make a curved battery. Because you actually okay. have to have a real curved battery in order to get this form factor. Um, LG Display makes our TVs. They had to actually make a curved, flexible display. So, it's a plastic OLED, a P OLED. Um, we just had our, one of our designers, um, Mr. Lee talk about that, how he actually had to challenge our sister companies, like, look, you guys have to make a curved battery for us. <laughs> and they were probably, you know, five years ago, yeah. going, what? what? But they did it. So, again, world's first curved, flexible smartphone. So but you can- But I notice it's also tough because it's, like, you could put that in your back pocket and sit on it, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, what's the deal? So on my side, I've actually done it. So I yeah. wouldn't, you know, not intended for that, but I'm probably bigger than the weight limit is on it. Uh, but yeah, it, you can flex it to flat, and it will withstand about 88 pounds of pressure okay. more than 100 times over and over. I mean, so if you did sit on it by accident or drop it, or you've got a little bit more durability yeah. with it, yeah. Now, on the subject of durability, this yep. also has a, a self-healing back on it too, doesn't it? Yeah, you guys know all about this phone already, <laughs> huh? um, It does. It's, it's a self-healing proprietary uh, resin, for lack of, or a polymer from okay. LG. So if you had it in your, <laughs> he's bringing out his, Can we test that? <laughs> I'm just kidding, not I'm just kidding. Not meant for you know, <laughs> <laughs> illegal knives in Vegas, but it is meant for if you have it in your pocket, keys, rings, your wife or girlfriend has it in her purse or clutch, and so it, you know, it will recover faster to look like more like new over time, right? Okay. It's not meant for someone to 
put a cut through it, but it does heal itself uh, to look close to new over time. So you can have, you know, you can have that fresh look longer. But how Excellent. about a case for it? Because honestly, I mean, I know it's tough and durable and scratch resistant, but I guarantee I will scratch it. I do this. I'm hard on phones. Yeah. You so, can't take them anywhere. Yeah, nice. you can't. Can, can, can I get some kind of a curved case for it to actually, you know, keep you know, protect it from me. Yep, you can. There are two different ones out there, or a couple of different ones out there right now, but you can, if you want, put it over. There's one that also looks almost like a T, like a, a brace or the old automotive bra styles, where you leave that camera exposed and the rear button exposed. So if you're right or left hand, you use it just easily. Um, and it does flex, obviously, with the phone. Yeah. So they're available. Um, I don't, you know, I, I think, like it is now, it's pretty durable, but, you know, so you may not need a case. And in a, a phablet kind of category with a six inch, six inch screen, you're probably fine. But if you need it, they, we have it. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Any other biggies that we need to be aware of? Anything you want, any bombs you just want to drop? Nobody's watching this <laughs> show. Yeah, nobody, uh, no one's on the chat right now. <laughs> nah, uh, those are pretty big bombs right now. I think there's more to come. I think, you know, the biggest one was this and the TV we just talked about. Um, so, I mean, I think LG's, the, you know, poised to come back in mobile uh, to the forefront again. and. The, the display's been there for years, so, you know, it's, it's more to come. Awesome. Awesome. Excellent. Yeah. Life's good. Life's good. Life's okay, good. guys, thanks a lot. Thanks for joining us, Chad. Absolutely. Thanks and you guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. we got a lot more coverage coming right after this.